Today, we're gonna create some of the weirdest Pokemon you've ever seen by fusing them together with mad science. Should be fun. This is Pokemon Infinite Fusion. And as you can see, we can take any Pokemon and fuse it together with any other Pokemon and create some very, very strange combinations. Look, what is this? A Nidto King and a Slope? <laughs> I'll, I'll call him Slow King. Or, or King Slow. What? Chansey and Butterfly? But Butterfree? Oh my gosh, what? Okay, anyways, I th I love this. This seems ridiculous. Also, did you see that the the Chansey Butterfree had a Metapod in like her little pouch? This is nuts. So I've used the power of like hacks and mods to basically put myself in a position where I have a bunch of different Pokemon that I can fuse together and I can also level them up very quickly and we're just gonna have a lot of fun creating some truly horrifying abominations. Let's go organize slash fuse. Okay, here, here are the Pokemon that I have. Um, oh, I already have a <laughs> Squirtasaur. Incredible. So that must be a Squirtle and a Bulbasaur combined. I actually, I kind of want to take this one out. Oh, my party's full. So if I understand correctly, you can also evolve the horrible abominations that you create. So let's just test that here real quick. So I got this Squirtle Sore out here in Viridian City. Let's go to my bag. I'm pretty sure that I have, yeah, I have a lot of rare candies. So I'm gonna use these rare candies on my Squirt Sore and um, we're gonna see what happens. Squirt Sore wants to learn withdraw. That's a terrible attack. No one wants that. Give up on learning withdraw i don't even remember when these pokemon evolve but you're level 12 now you're level 13 you want to learn poison powder which is weird because you're a water type but you're also a grass type and now you have a poison attack sure let's replace tackle with poison powder oh and you also want to learn sleep powder <laughs> no the poison powder is good enough Bubble? You want to learn bubble now, too? Uh, the leech seed is, is a terrible attack. Get rid of leech seed. Replace it with bubble. Okay, congratulations, Squirt Sore. You're, you're awesome. Oh, it's happening. Squirt Sore is evolving into what? <laughs> Ivy Turtle? Ivy Turtle? Maybe? Like, because it's uh, Ivy Sore and War Turtle? Congratulations, your Squirt Sore evolved into squ Squirt Sore. It's the same name, but it does look different. And it now wants to learn bite. I would not want to be bit by that terrible looking creature. Let's replace poison powder. Oh, it's evolving again. What? Dude. <laughs> I don't know. But it's going to be a, a Venusaur and a, and a Blastoise. No. You're, you're Warsaur. I'm so confused. I think the game's confused. We're all confused. This is awesome. I love being confused. I think we want to get to level 32, but it's taking a really long time because I have to keep like learning and not learning attacks. Because it's a fusion between Ivysaur and War Turtle, they both learn like the attacks that they would normally learn. So you're basically learning attacks from two different Pokemon at the same time. It's too many attacks. Stop. 32, right? Yes. Yes. Oh, it's happening. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's it's Venusaur shaped ish kind of. It, it's a blue Venusaur. I mean, it, it has like the war turtle uh, ears and the tail, which is really funny to see. Uh, it wants to learn pedal dance, which eh, pedal dance is a pretty good attack, right? Yeah, let's replace Vine Whip. But I have a feeling that if I give it another rare candy, it's going to evolve again. Am I crazy? Aqua Tail? What the heck is Aqua Tail? I don't know. I don't want it. No? Level 34? Are you done? Are you done evolving? No, you're not. No, you are not. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, this is definitely Blastoise-ish. Uh, it's standing up. Blastoise. 
blast sore. Honestly, you look awesome. I'm, uh, that is incredible. Okay, we have a blast sore now. So that test has been confirmed. You can take a beginning level evolution and get it up to a max level evolution. You can skip that whole process though by just taking like a Charizard and combining it with, you know, like a Venusaur, for instance. I do have some wild looking options. Let's take Pikachu, a classic, and fuse him with a an execute? I don't even know. I don't know. What's this gonna do? We're doing it. We're we're turning Pikachu into into eggs. What's it gonna do? What's it gonna do, man? Oh gosh, it's Pikachu with Execute's face. Execu. That's a great name. That's a great name. I love him. He's a mouse egg Pokemon, and he is beautiful. <laughs> Oh man, I, uh, combine their movesets, I guess. Now, could I give this thing a Thunderstone and turn it into a, like a Raichu sort of like evolution? I don't even know this. Oh my gosh, this is like hurting my brain, but also just truly delightful. What do we do now? What do we do? We take a, oh my God, we have Magikarp. Let's fuse and we have Mew. <laughs> Are we fusing a Magikarp with a Mew right now? Yes. Yes, we are. Absolutely. Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? And then, you know what? And then we need to rare candy the heck out of this thing and turn it into a Gyarados Mew. It's a Mew Carp. And I love it. Please join my team. We need to do some battles. I feel like, are there any trainers around here that we can... We can battle with our extremely, extremely cursed Mew Carp. I found myself inside of Viridian Forest, right? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. This is a dead end. Let's battle. Oh, buddy. You have no idea what you're about to see. Wait, what if he has a weird... He has a weird... It's a... It's a Diglett and a, a Whooper? Is that what I'm looking at? Also, I have a level five Charizard. That... That seems like really bad. I mean, it's kind of awesome, but also like, I don't know how well this is gonna go for me. I need to change. I need to swap out for my, uh, my Mew Carp is gonna die, but let's just, let's just switch it in just to see it in action. How stupid is this? <laughs> it looks so bad. Oh, but I kind of love it. Uh, uh, Pound, I guess. I don't really have any good attacks as Mew Carp. Go figure. Who would have thought? Really, Woolet? You're just gonna tail whip me? That's all you're gonna do? Just over and over again? Okay. Yeah. No, that's gonna hurt. Okay. That's fair. That's. I, I'm. I'm about to die. Yep. That's a. That's a dead Mew Carp. That's okay. Mew Carp isn't even my strongest Pokemon. Oh no. I call on you, Blastosaur. Oh my gosh, you're so cool. You're so cool. And you are like unbelievably overpowered because you have water and grass attacks. Um, yeah, I win, you lose, I'm the best, you're the worst, Sean. Just you wait until my Pokemon evolves. What would a Woolet turn into? Anyways, um, I should revive my, uh, my Mew Carp and then we should evolve our Mew Carp into a Mew, Mew, Mugados? Garamu? What would you call it? I don't know. We're using rare candies on our Mew Carp, and we're getting this guy stacked. What level does Magikarp turn into Gyarados? Hey Siri, what level does Magikarp evolve at? Level 20. Level 20. Level 20! I, all I had to do was just press A literally once. <laughs> Here we go. We're gonna have ourselves a, a Mugados. A Garamu. I hate it. It's a Mewdos. <laughs> it's so bad. Oh, it's so bad. It looks like a worm. It looks just like a worm with weird wings. Oh, let's make some more. Oh my gosh. The opportunity that we have here for absolute chaos is just 
truly magical. What do we do? I mean, we can make some truly awesome Pokemon too, right? Like Umbreon? Oh my gosh. Umbreon and Gardevoir? I mean, that sounds pretty insane. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Yes. Fuse them. They are being fused. <laughs> I don't know what this thing's gonna look like, though. Yo, that's actually pretty sick. I bit my tongue right there. I got so excited, I bit my tongue. Gardereon. Moonlight Embrace Pokemon. That is awesome. Yes. Combine movesets, I guess. I'm so adding this guy to my team. You can also unfuse your Pokemon, but who would ever want to do that? Give me a Charizard and... <sighs> I don't even know, man. Charizard and Murkrow? That could be interesting. You know what? Let's give it a give it a shot. They are being fused. Yes, yes, they are. What? Dude, dude. Murizard. That is insane looking. I love it. Dark fire type. Welcome to the crew. Um, adding him to my team, of course. Okay, now, is there any super weird ones that we can do? Oh, Snorlax. I gotta do something with Snorlax. What about <laughs> Snorlax and Executor? Yes. Make it happen. What, what even, like, what can you say? <laughs> Execulax. <laughs> it sounds like a... Sounds like a medication you would take maybe to to get things moving in your in your system. Exegulax. <laughs> I definitely want to hear suggestions from you guys. If there are particular fusions that you guys want to see, let me know. Obviously, I only have these Pokemon right now, but I can get more. I can definitely get more. Mr. Mime. Oh my gosh, Mr. Mime and Mewtwo. Where's Mewtwo? There you are. This is going to be awful. Why am I doing this? There's nothing good can come from this. It's just... I'm so scared. Mew Mime. It's Mew Mime, everybody. Okay, so I have room for one more truly atrocious creation. What do we do? I love the idea of doing something with Jigglypuff. Yes, Fuse with I mean I got so many options do we go Jigglypuff and Jolteon yes please you have so much potential to be everything I've ever wanted and you are, you look like a, a a Jiggly Pikachu a Jolt Puff that is a beautiful name for a beautiful fusion I love it I truly love it. Welcome to the team. I'm so happy that you're here. So now I have my crew. I kind of want to go do like a gym battle if I can. All right. I have no idea where I'm going, but I'm going and we're going to battle and we're going to use this tremendous squad that we've created that is truly unstoppable. A Pokemon jumped out of this web. What? What are you? What is that? Duobal? <laughs> I, I don't know about that one. All right, I uh, hit, hit him with the Thunder Fang. It doesn't affect him because he's ground type. I'm dumb. How about a double kick? What do you think of that? Yeah? It's not very effective. Well, guess what? I'm still going to do it again because it's probably the only attack that I can use against you. Yeah, let's go. Can I go through here now? The, another Pokemon. All right, fair enough. Oh my gosh, it got so dark. Okay, we already beat this kid. My Blastosaurus was too strong. But now we need to find a way out of here. Oh, we got another trainer to battle. You're a bug catcher, aren't you? So you're gonna bust out a weird bug type. Let's see what you got. Oh, you got three? Azubat? Okay, but I have bad news for you. Thunder Fang is going to destroy you. I'm sorry. Let's try out a different Pokemon. How about Mewdos? 
Gotta love him. There's that sweet, sweet boy. Mudos the worm. What are you, P drill? I don't even I don't even know what you are. But you need to leave. You need to get out of here. No one wants to look at that thing anymore. <laughs> what is that? Uh Alright, Gardarion, get out there. Do something cool. Fee Kern? What? Why? You look so sad. <laughs> what happened to that thing? Alright, alright. There you go, bug catcher Jim. You're done. We got another bug catcher. Oh boy. Bug catcher Rick Azu Seed. <laughs> it's, it's just. Ah, oh man. Wow. You are. You are something. You are definitely something. That's the best I got for you. It's just covered in spikes. Yes, let's switch out our Pokemon. Let's go Mir Mirazard. This is probably the coolest one that we created, right? Like, I mean, look at this thing. It's a crow. It's a dragon. You're a... <laughs> you're a, a whooper and execute. What happened? Why would you do that? Also, why would I use fire on a water type? I don't know. Because I'm bad at video games? Whatever. I'm stronger than you because I have cheats. Sorry. All right, get me out of here. How do I get out of this place? Oh, here we go. We did it. Wait, wait, I want to battle you. Let's do this. Lana, what? Fletchling, you're, you're kind of cool looking. I like you. You're dead, but I like you. I don't even know what that was a combination of. Like genuinely, I, I know that one was, uh, I forget the name of that bird type Pokemon, but either way, we, we kicked its butt. All right, we made it to Pewter City. I'm pretty sure there is a uh, Pokemon gym here, right? Pokemon gym. Yes. Uh, I should probably take my Pokemon to get healed. <laughs> Let's take them to the Poke Center first. Pokemon gym. Here we go. I can tell you have what it takes to become a Pokemon chat champ. Brock uses rock type Pokemon. You'll have to be real tough to gain the advantage against him. Take this. I'm pretty sure Brock in the original game had an Onix. I don't know what he will have in this game, but first we got to fight his minions. Magihorn. <laughs> oh. It's... It's hideous. It's... Oh, gosh. So, is, is that a, um, a Rhinehorn and a Magikarp? So, probably not going to use Thunder on him. Fighting isn't really going to... Is fighting... Fighting did a lot of damage. Wow. Okay. I was not ex expecting that, but there you go. Um, I win. Because I have weirder Pokemon than you. Actually, that's not true. That thing was really weird. Stop. You are light years from Brock. Uh-huh. Okay. I Iglis... What? Iglisly? You're a Jigglypuff. And, uh... And something else... That I cannot make sense of. At all. You're just... You just... You need to go away. <laughs> that's all I know. Okay. Sub... Sudub... Sudo boss? Okay. Um, let's send out Mew Me. It's time for for Mew Me. Or Mew Mime. Whatever you want to call him. Subbo. So what? Okay, hit him with the hit him with a psi wave. Yeah. That's the ticket. Okay. Fortunately, that did like no damage, and I win. Here he is. Brock, the man. The myth, the legend. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. Do you still want to challenge me? Fine then. All right, I can only use two Pokemon. I'm gonna go with Blastasaur because he's insane. And let's go Mewmos. All right, let's do this, Brock. What do you got? What do you got? Geopip? It's a Hoppip and a Geodude. That's, that's very good. I'm going to hit you with a water pulse, and you're just going to get melted. <laughs> yeah, that's so strong. Oh, I'm way too strong to be at this point in the game, but I'm kind of okay with it. And then let's go Mudos, little worm boy. Get him in there. Armadil? Armadil? What? I don't, I don't know what you are, but I'm going to punch you with my no arms. Or, or I'm going to bite you? I guess I'm going to bite you. Okay. It is kind of weird that 
I have a worm Pokemon that uses uh, a punch. Uses his arms. That's that's weird, but we did just win, so... What do you think of that, Brock? Your weird Pokemon weren't as weird as my weird Pokemon. I win the weird battle. Boom. One step closer to becoming the weirdest Pokemon master ever.